Hi friends, this is Akshay. Welcome to you all on Career Edge. Firstly, a very happy Independence Day to you all. Today we are on the platform of Microsoft and we are going to see how to register for Microsoft Learn Student Ambassadors. What are the benefits of Student Ambassador of Microsoft? How to register and what to do? We are going to see all these points in this video firstly you need to apply for microsoft ambassador program after that you need to complete your profile if you select it then microsoft guide you what to do and after that why you should apply for this make a difference with students from around the world grow your skills you and build your reputation as a tech insider become a leader in your local tech community and also improve the skills of your peers what you get in this ambassador program there are three badges you can see on your screen the three badges are namely alpha beta and gold what you get in this badge is what are rewards you can see on your screen if you get gold then you get alpha and beta benefits microsoft most valuable professional mentorship and also you may be invited to the mvp program Now I am going to explore little bit more about this badges. Now you can see on your screen there are some ambassadors with their reviews and how it works. I am going to show you how this whole Microsoft ambassador program works and what to do. Here you can see on your screen what to do is welcome Microsoft Learn Student ambassadors. As a student ambassador you are a unique position to solve real world problem establish yourself as mentors and leaders in your communities also you are joining a global online network to collaborate with leaks that are focused on a specific issues you also be able to connect directly with experts and mentors at microsoft also you can earn recognition and build your reputation as a tech insider There are some paths which Microsoft suggests when you are selected for this ambassador program for a college there is only one ambassadors from the Microsoft Microsoft student ambassadors get free access to best in class Microsoft 365 apps and there are many rewards if you are selected for this and also this shows your leadership skills and you can add this in your resume which affects very very much your resume which makes your resume outstanding now i am going to apply for this what is the application process of this now you can see on your screen firstly you need to sign in from your microsoft account not a google account if you have an account then you proceed with it and if you not have then make a new account and after that just tap on yes and then you can see one more options on your screen that is of downloading a microsoft app on your smartphone but doesn't need to do this now i am going to proceed this application process and you can see here is an application there are total 6 norms are there which we need to fulfill firstly there is a privacy and terms only you need to verify after that personal information academic institution infor- information written simple social media and additional information you can see a green tick on social media information because as you sign in in the microsoft account account is now access for some information in this microsoft ambassador program now i'm going to start with privacy and terms you can read all this information be at least 16 years old at the time of submission two more informations are there second is you are enrolled in full time courses in your institution college or university and have a valid identification which you need to submit here and after that just tap on i agree and wish to continue and then next now we are on the second step of application and here you need to fill up personal information in personal information first name last name gender gender pronoun preference contact email date of birth select your country region and the state of provenance only this much information are needed you can see i filled up all these boxes and after that here there is some more information needed and this is the third part of this application 
here you need your phone code means if you are in india then it is plus 91 you can also browse your country here and after that your primary phone number which you use in a daily basis and after giving this information just tap on next now academic institution informations are needed here there is an also option of state you need to mention the state where your college is located here name of your college in country and region you need to fill up your country name where your college is located we completed three of the norms degree program you can select btech degree bs degree normally the degree you are pursuing and after that degree level and expected date of graduation i completed four of these norms and only two informations are remain now i am going to show you the most important step that is written sample here you need to answer in a long paragraph about what excites you about technology and why do you want to help other students to explore and learn you need to write with your own there is no sample answers for this because it is your own reviews you can write as much as you want you need to upload a video with this same topic and also you need to upload the video link here just make a video on the above topic and upload it in any platform and paste the link here next question is how do you take a technical concept and teach it to be a friend or peer who has never heard of it means if you wants to explain about microsoft ambassador program then how you can explain the last is to promote you can promote this by arranging by organizing some events on your college and also you need to upload this all information if you select it in microsoft ambassador program this is the last step where you need to mention your all social media handles link twitter instagram blogspot or any website if you have a resume online means if you uploaded it on your google drive then you need to upload the url also github and linkedin profile url is also need to paste here these all things show your connectivity with social media community you can see stack overflow profile filling up all the boxes are not compulsory this is on you how much you want to give your relevant information to microsoft but I suggest you upload all these links because it makes more chances to get you selected. Last is in which subjects you are interested. So just choose all the topics which interests you more and after that just go to the next. Firstly fill up all these boxes those things which you want in your topics field of interests are this and after that after completing this just tap on next as this is the last step then there is an option of submit and after submitting this form you need to check your email regularly if was microsoft inform you about your selection on your email account i am writing sample answers and completed all the five other things so you also complete it and just share it with your friends so they also get benefited <music>